So the qualifiers are up next, the Moors Millions and the Starters All Championship. So first up is the Moors Millions. Three mile, three furlong handicap, Miller train slain for Thomas Rogers, come on blue chip for Stu Gray, Clam Fraser for Stu Gray, subcontract for Craig Beckwith, Subway set for Kevin Meenahan, catch him over hassle for Thomas Rogers, finding Alice for Martin Edema, Viva La Rock for Kevin Meenahan are the eight runners we have. So now the three miles and three furlongs. Try and get to one of the last remaining tickets for the Moors Millions finals. I think we might have another qualifying week 12 but I'm not 100% certain so this might be a last chance so here at Hereford in the mud a 3 mile 3 furlong qualifier we've got plenty of reluctant leaders into the first of the 21 now we've lost one at the first and it's subway set for Kevin Meenham that's gone unlucky although he's got Viva La Rock in here as they come down to the second it's going to be Miller Train Slain Thomas Rogers that's going to lead us into it that wide clan frays up. Two greys jump that well. Joviva and Rock sort of on the outside of the grey. Martin Leadham's finding Alice. And we've got clan Fraser subcontract and climb on blue chip. Catching over Hassel just bringing up the rear. But it's Miller Train Slain that still leads us. Well, reluctantly, there's no pace on here. As they slog through the mile. We go through the first half mile. So it's Miller Train Slain. Joviva and Rock. Finding Alice. That's a winning post. Two more circuits. Lost sight of catching over Hassel at the moment. There he is. So past the TV camera now. And he widens it. So it's a go with the fourth. Oh, we've lost another one this time. It's come on blue chip for Stu Gray that's gone. Stake there unseated. He's right up. Enough. Stu's still got Clan Fraser in here. He's sitting in fifth position at the moment. A couple of lengths ahead of catching over Hassel. The leader is still Miller Train Slain, the top weight. Takes him over the ditch. So a jump there by second place Viva La Rock that shuffles back and allows subcontract for Great Bet to take up second place. A little wider is Clan Fraser. Then between the those is Finding Alice as it goes to the sixth. And just at the rear is catching over Hassel. Miller train slay. By five, it's a subcontract. And Clam Fraser in trouble with the loose horse, pushing him wide. Against the fence is the grey Viva of Rock. And it's the seventh. A third of the fence is taken. Miller train slay was a little bit slow over that. Still the loose horse pushing uh, Clam Fraser wide all the time. So, as we go to the eighth, big slow jump there by subcontract in second. He's probably a length from the lead up. He's Miller Train Slain. He's still five back. Get to the ditch. And uh, subcontract was a little slow over that, so he's got a five six length advantage as Miller Train Slain. Subcontract in second. There's a further three lengths back to Viva La Rock Clan Fraser and out wide to catch an over hassle. Although the loose horse still causing problems to those two out wide. And then finding Alice at the rear. Just keeping his head in the frame. Another train train slain. It's down to the next by three or four to subcontract in second. Slow over that one again, subcontract, and plenty of air. Still on his feet. We've got the loose horse still. And wide is catching over Hassel. Moving to third. Not Clown Fraser and Viva La Rock. Another grey finding Alice pushing through. And take the 11th. So I jumps at the rear this time by Viva La Rock and Clan Fraser. Train Slane's been jumping well, maintaining his lead. He'll just race slightly downhill. A dip there. A mile and a half to travel. Another circuit to go. It's still Miller Train Slane. Since the 12th, which will be the last next time round. So Miller Train Slane from subcontract to catch over hassle. We've comfortably up alongside now. And a couple of lengths back to the improving Finding Alice. And we've got a rock on the inside. Clam Fraser now bringing up the rear. There's a race rate right handed. And it towards the back straight. Which is the 13th. Get over that well. So 
but still this Miller train slain. These leads down to four now, to subcontract in second, finding Alice is third, catching over Hassel's new boat towards the fence now in fourth. And wider is the other gravy, but a rock, and Clan Fraser a couple of lengths off the pack. Come to the 14th, the lead is over it well. And we'll took that ditch well. So with a mile left to travel, it's this Miller train slain, slowly Moving up well on the outside is finding Alice as she moves into second. Although went through the top of that one, shuffles back and gives second place back to subcontract. Wide outside is Viva La Rock. Catch another hassle being given a few reminders. Clown Fraser wanting to play with the loose horse again. If we come downhill, it's Miller Train slain to subcontract in second. Miller Train slain was slow over that little jump to that one much better. Viva La Rock got away from it best. So with six furlongs still to run, before the take, it's Miller Train slain from subcontract. And over that well, towards the rear now, catching over Hassel and Clam Fraser, they've got to be pushed along a little bit in this mud, with five furlongs left to run. It's still Miller Train slain. Over the big ditch, jumps it well, as does the chasers. So Miller Train slain from Beaver La Rock, making a move up on the outside now. Finding Alice and Subcontract, both got the whip out, but slowing up a little bit. Moving well on the outside is Clan Fraser, catching over Hassel's got a bit of work to do. But it's Miller Train slain, the whip's out. We're inside the final half mile, and it's Miller Train slain from Viva La Rock, running on well on the wide outside is Clan Fraser in the mud. As we come down to the next, the 19th, it's three from home, and it's Miller Train slain from Viva La Rock. Clan Fraser, Subcontract coming back into this great jump there by Viva La Rock and jumps himself into the lead. So it's Viva La Rock that leads now from Miller Train Slane. Doesn't look like he's got anything left. Running on really well now is Subcontract. We come down to the final quarter mile with just two to take and it's Viva La Rock. Gets into it, goes through the top of it. Miller Train Slane jumps himself back alongside. Viva La Rock, Miller Train Slane and Subcontract and Clan Fraser. They race down here with a third and a half to go and one to jump. It's Viva La Rock to Subcontract in second. Clan Fraser in third. Miller Train Slane still trying to run on again as he starts to go backwards from catching over Hassel. So up front is Viva La Rock, but here comes Subcontract and Clan Fraser to come into the last. It's down to the jump. Clan Fraser was the fastest, and it's Clan Fraser that's nosing in front now. Clan Fraser, there's Subcontract, and Subcontract just gets up. Subcontract takes it from Clan Fraser and Viva La Rock. Right on the line, so another win there for Craig Beckworth. Well done. Picks up the Moors Millions. All three of those will qualify. Deservedly so, because if it's over three miles three, so subcontract Clan Fraser and Viva La Rock all go to the final. Should they want to, so Clan Fraser Stu Grade was second, third was Viva La Rock for Kevin Meenahan, fourth was Cachanosa Hassel for Thomas Rogers, along with Miller Train Slane, our long time leader, in fifth.